Sex education courses, something most of us have had to sit through during our school days. But for Austin ISD, it's not going to look like what we remember as kids. The district's proposed changes to their sex education classes has stirred up debate. New this morning, they want parents to share their thoughts on what the new plan looks like. KV's Tori Larned joins us now. And Tori, there's going to be a survey, right? Correct. Starting this morning, parents can now log on to their Austin ISD account, look at the specific lessons and take a survey about these new courses. The district approved the proposed changes back in February, but not everybody is on board with it. Their survey is only for the courses that will be taught at the middle school level. Some of the changes under the new curriculum include teaching students about defining their identity and how to respect everyone's own choices. It'll also teach students about protective measures during sex and and emergency contraception. So now some parents are concerned these discussions are inappropriate for children to be learning at such a young age, while others believed it's important to give all students, including in the LGBTQ community, a safe place to understand sexuality and relationships. This district teaches kids to say no to drugs, alcohol, smoking, vaping. Why not engaging in sexual activity? They've been using word gymnastics to spin things like the fact that registration forms say parent or guardian into the idea that the district won't allow the terms mother and father. Or they misconstrue the standard, misconstrue the standard of identifying diverse family structures as promoting kids to be gay. Now, if parents don't want their kids taking part in one particular course or if any course at all, they still do have the choice to opt out. Instead, they'll take courses in social emotional learning. In a letter to parents, the district says they will use this feedback to revise those lessons before sending them on for a final review. Now, students will take those courses next May. So uh, there are a lot of changes going on there, but big debate is great. Oh, yeah, a big lot debate. Of, and they've been, they've been willing to listen, which is a good mm -hmm. thing. Absolutely. No doubt about There's it. There's an open conversation. And we want to thank you for joining us. I'm sure you're thinking, well, thank who's you. this nice young lady? We have Tori Larned, and you, you're coming from Lubbock, right? I am coming from Lubbock. I traded the wind for the humidity. <laughs> so. That's an even trade up. I don't go. think anybody wins yeah. in that deal. No, but you've got never. ties to Austin. You know all about this city. I have. Mm -hmm. I've been here all the time. Yeah. I love running around Lady Bird Lake getting mm -hmm. out. Now, the difference between Lubbock and here is that when you walk around Lubbock on the streets, people ask you, are you okay? So walking's not a thing there. So I'm happy to be somewhere. I walk out and everyone's like, yeah, you go, girl. Are so. you okay? I love that. Are you? Are you? Yeah. Well, we're sure glad to have you here. Thank You'll you. be seeing a lot more, Tori, throughout the day here on Daybreak in the weeks to come. Thank you.